Yo guys, what is going on? Welcome back to a brand new WWE Supergirl video, episode 91. With me, cool guy, and you, the amazing viewers. I know what the amazing. Yes, guys, you guys are amazing. <laughs> and what was the other word? And the awesome viewers. I don't know. I completely forgot. Ah, shows shows how good my memory is. Anyways, um, I've got a really exciting thing to show you guys. But oh, you already have seen it, so it's just exciting for me at this point. Chris Jericho is the next event card. Goodness, I am so happy. So, um, as you guys know, Jack Gallagher, before this, was the best card. Now, I'm going to check for you guys, because I don't actually know who's better, but I believe Chris Jericho is better. What the actual fuck? Okay. Wow. Wow, wow, okay. So apparently Chris Joko is a lot better. Okay then. He is a lot better. <laughs> yeah, because um, basically, let, let, me, let me just... I'll clarify this for you guys really quickly. Um, Goldberg's the worst by quite a bit, okay? And then Mankind has got 27,078. Neville, 27,078. Shane McMahon, 27,079. Bret Hart, 27,080. Randy Orton, 27,080. Jack Gallagher, 27,088. Which is eight, you know, which is quite a bit more compared to one, two difference. That had eight difference, so that was quite a bit. And now Chris Jericho is 27,270. So almost 200 points. That's, that's all their, all their points. All their, like, without, without the car being leveled up. So a level zero. Uh, power, toughness, speed, charisma, add it up, and that's the total you get. Um, so yeah, Chris Joko is the best by quite a bit. Now, do we know his arrow? He is a left arrow. Insane. Speed, charisma, that we know. Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Alright guys, so, we're going to get into Chris Joko a little bit there at the beginning, explaining to you guys how, you know, with the best cards and those kind of things. I'd like to clarify one more thing before we actually get into some gameplay today, and that is concerning my team, okay? I loved, I love it. I love having a team. It feels so awesome, and you know, you, you guys are so cool, and so happy meeting all you new people, and, and it's, it's a fun thing to do. But lately, I'm getting spammed on Twitter, on my YouTube sections, on Discord, on, on everything possible. I've even got someone on Snapchat talking to me about joining my team. So... To anybody who wants to join my team, and I know there are a lot of you out there who do want indeed join my team, but please listen up. I will let you guys know when there are spots available. In my daily videos, I will let you guys know how you can join, the way to join, when, you know, all that kind of thing. So just watch my daily videos if you guys want to know more about this. I've explained it all in the past that <clears throat> for every uh, team event, there'll be someone in the lower tier that we're going to help him get the event card. He'll be kicked at the end. B-King will be kicked before the next event, by the way. Uh, really nice guy. I'm glad he got his Rusev. That bumped him up into Harden tier, which is really awesome for him. Uh, which he got Harden free. But I'll like, awesome. Um, so yeah, we're waiting, I'm waiting for still a couple people to join the team, uh, and we'll get that all sorted out for the next team event, but please guys, stop spamming me with the messages, I will let you guys know when, um, yeah, Fatboy, is that, is that, is that, which Fatboy is that, I don't even know which Fatboy is that, if it's Fatboy from Discord or not, anyway, but let's get into some gameplay, yes guys, you came to the right place, it took a little bit of while, it took a while, but we're gonna, we're gonna go do this. So the Elite card is an NXT card, the Ultimate is a Smackdown, and the event is obviously Chris Jericho, what an awesome card, I'm so happy. Let's go with that, we'll get our Jack Gallagher in here in a sec, oh come on, we need toughness, toughness power, if you proc, Mankind, no, you didn't, you didn't, you didn't, you didn't do, you didn't do well enough. Okay, let's get Neville down there. Speed, speed, sp oh, we've got speed. Yeah, we won that. Yeah, yeah, we won that. Awesome. Okay, so we're back on track now. Can we, f I've never filled up a whole thing with all of end cards. Uh, it won't be possible, because obviously I have to put, yeah, it won't be possible, but we'll get pretty close. Speed again, oh, he's won that this time. I think I, s I s still should be able to win this. Yeah, I think we're good. Well, well, we'll get, let's, oh, I don't know actually what we're going to do. Let's put that there, and then no matter where he goes, I can, I can. Alright, we need power or toughness. 
toughness and speed. Oh dear. No. All right, we've lost. Even if I challenge him, we've lost. All right, let's just take the loss then. It's unfortunate, but it is what it is. It's disappointing. It's very, very disappointing. It is what it is. <laughs> All right, let's see. Full picks. Let's go. Let's just go with the big ones. It almost never is for me at the beginning, but who knows? Who knows? Who knows? I hope I don't have to go down to the last one every time. That's going to be a bit annoying. Next game. Let's do this. Um, thank you guys, by the way. I like a bit a bit of backstory. The goodbye video I did, the 39 second video. Let me quickly explain for people who didn't really understand and who commented, that, oh, you know, this point. It's just people didn't really understand the video. Um, we had two people on the team, absolute dickheads, trolls, who deserve to be kicked. They were just absolute arseholes in the team chat and just trolling, lowering their decks, not letting us get the ultimate card and... And one of them finally, like in the last in the last two hours, quickly changed his deck back, and then. But overall, both of them deserve to get kicked. I kicked both of them, and if you guys didn't really understand why, that's why. But back to this game, we are gonna win this one, which is a good thing. Uh, get our eight picks instead of our four picks. We'll use probably Brett. There we go, Brett Hart, and that's a win. Lovely. So guys, we're SmackDown and Raw over the last couple of days that I haven't even spoken about or mentioned. So I want to go to Raw really quickly and think and talk to you guys what I think about Raw in a couple words. I'm not going to go through all the matches, just going to, in a couple words, sum it up. Roman Reigns and The Undertaker, I don't like it, I hate it, and I think it's a mis huge mistake. But it is what it is. If Roman Reigns wins, absolute riot, I think, should happen. Like we, Everybody should riot. But that aside, we'll see what the match gives us. Yeah, Raw are shit, like seriously, Raw are shit, they rely on part-timers to be their champs, to be their main eventers, while actually Smackdown use their talent and their good wrestlers in the main event positions and actually have good storylines and interesting builds and it's just not, oh yeah, let's get you, you're a 50 year old part-timer, let's get you back in here, oh yeah, you, let's get you back in here, alright, main event WrestleMania, Brock Lesnar, Goldberg, yeah, who doesn't, yeah, great, fantastic, no. Fuck that. Um, and just Raw in general is such utter shit. But whatever. And I don't understand the whole, oh, Undertaker, he's always been blue, he's smacked down through, you know, in the blood, he's got blue blood, whatever, you know, how they were hyping Undertaker when he came to SmackDown the first time after the brand split, how, you know, how loyal and how he's always been on SmackDown. And since then, we haven't seen him on SmackDown, so. Really? Are you, or are you just on Raw? So, you know. That annoyed me. Um, I love Kevin Owens. I love Chris Jericho. I like Sami Zayn, all that. But what I didn't understand over this Monday Night Raw is Chris Jericho gets getting attacked, and then Sami Zayn comes to rescue him. Two weeks ago, they were enemies, and it just made no sense. And now you see them all buddy buddy, and they're at That that annoyed me. And apart from that, I'll probably stop uh, ranting on Raw. I just you know, Smojo Jericho. Good match. Um, Sasha Banks versus Bailey. I actually didn't watch that match. I know um, I should. I should have watched that match. Um, it's an absolute disaster that I haven't watched that match. And then SmackDown really quickly, guys. Good, good show. Not one of their best, but not one of their worst. Um, yeah, the main event was good. Wrong winner in my opinion, but it is what it is. Um, Alexa Bliss and Mickey James. Mickey James turning on Alexa Bliss. Great. Uh, going to be going to be good matches between the both of them. Um, oh yeah, I forgot. Baron Corbin tried to commit murder as well. That was good. It was all cool. Yeah, loved that. Um, and, and yeah, that was that was pretty much SmackDown at the main event. Oh yeah, and then James Ellsworth, Carmella, and against John Cena and Nikki Bella. That'd have, like pretty much yeah, that's it. That is it. But yeah, it was good. It was good. It was a good show. Better than Raw. Way better than Raw. Let's get into another game. This is going to be a long episode. We haven't had a nice long episode of Supercard in a while. So get your get your get your phones, get your whatever your blue stacks, and grind alongside with me. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna end this video until we don't until we get the first shard. Uh, what else, what else did I have to, did I want to talk about? So I don't have to. But what did I want to talk about? Um, yeah, the fact I really want to see Sasha Banks Bailey now. <laughs> 
Kann bleiben, aber nur ein Mensch. Okay. Let's go there. Brock Lesnar down there. We should be good to win this game. Yeah, we're good. We are all good. Perfect. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. Let's get our eight picks on the board. Hopefully this time we can get ourselves a shard. We got we got a one in two chance. Basically. Come on, just give me that goddamn shard. Alright, yay! We got a shard. Woo! So much of, of, of this person has been revealed. Tiny bit of, yeah, I don't even know what that's meant to be. Guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you have enjoyed it. I went on a little bit about Raw and SmackDown. I know, sorry about that. Went on a bit at the beginning about the event cards. But I hope now you guys know how the events are ranked. Chris Jericho is the best and by quite a nice margin. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you can smash 40 likes on it, that would be absolutely massively appreciated. And until I see you guys next, take care and peace out.